Hi again. Well, we will show you uh, in the following video how to test uh, the sample that we have prepared before. So, first of all, what we have to do to test our polarimeter is simulate more or less the same conditions, the same electrical conditions that you have having power of 100. 10 volts more or less please see just the line one and frequency having the same frequency that you have in your laboratory 60 Hz so after having the um, the electrical supply ready we have to turn on our polarimeter just clicking at the bot in the bottom at the at the back can you see it? okay just this pattern okay and then the polarimeter will be ready to work so you just need to wait for few minutes to uh, to have your polarimeter ready to take samples so then what you have to do is use your sample and put the sample inside the polarimeter making making you sure that the bubble is in the white part of our polarimeter tube okay then you just need to close and automatically the polarimeter will be working to take your sample so we need to wait to have a stable value for our first measurement as you can see the sample is still measuring the value okay so this is our first sample as you can see the number one in the display then to make you sure your measurement is good just click in this button once to obtain the second measurement wait for having number two then click again in the same button to have your third measurement and then you can obtain the average clicking in AB if you want to see the values of your samples you just need to click in one two three bottom to see the first measurement second one and third one that's all so then you have to take out your sample and let look and the value that you uh, have measured before the polarimeter needs to uh, to go to zero again to get new measurements as you can see there are other two buttons reset and clear 
and in the meantime when the polarimeter is decreasing until zero until its original zero if you click in reset or clear as you could see the polarimeter will give you negative values but remi remind that these are mm, the polarimeter it doesn't have right now any kind of uh, sample to measure and we have to wait for having the original zero of the polarimeter to finally click in reset or clear and our polarimeter will be ready to take the new the new sample so right now we need to click in reset for having our zero and then you can proceed to do a new measurement of your of your sample so we can we can repeat the measurement with the same uh, with the same sample or with different ones please eva put again the sample and then you just need to wait for having the values of your sample the values of angle for your sample We have previously calculated more or less that the sample that we have prepared before uh, has an angle more or less between 22 and 24 approximately. Okay, so then click in here to get the second measurement. This is the second one. And finally, clicking in the same button, we obtain the third one to get the average. And that's all.